Traffic fatalities fill local headlines, whether caused by weather conditions, speeding, or distracted drivers. But the U.S. Department of Transportation says traffic fatalities reached a 60-year low in 2010. And local police say car manufacturers may have had a lot to do with those numbers. The main focus with most all car manufacturers is to how, how to make a vehicle safer with airbags and, and the, the enhancements on, on all, all parts of the vehicle. Airbags aren't a new feature in cars, but local car dealers say today's manufacturers have figured out where they can be placed to be the most effective. What is new about them is the placement of airbags. Um, now they're putting um, side curtain airbags in to help um, with rollovers, um, heavy side impacts. The study shows new technology may have impacted the fatality rate, but officers say they're also working to make sure drivers are buckling up on the road. And the numbers show it's working. Recent studies show 84% of drivers say they wear their seat belts, a number that's up from just 50% in 1990 and 11% in 1980. Officers can't pull over drivers for not wearing a seat belt in West Virginia, but they say that power may help them save lives. Because we see that uh, the, the numbers of fatalities go down when the seatbelt usage goes up, so if we can pull people over for just not wearing their seatbelt and try to encourage people to wear their seatbelts, it, it could help with the number of fatalities in the future too. Future fatalities that police and car manufacturers alike are working to prevent. The new technology will help you know, with safety overall, as well as you know, keeping people from being distracted. They can keep you know, their eyes on the road. In Harrison County, I'm Ashton Mara for 5 News.